welcome to the final episode of the Monday Minute series. I thought it would be fitting to end as we began, so please enjoy one last spoken word poem with vibraphone accompaniment. February through June, we learned about teaching in videos that soon I hope will be far-reaching. Now, like in class, it's important to review. What have we learned? What was new to you? We started with Blackboard, the basics, and more, then syllabus engagement with ideas galore, then course navigation and the quick start guide, an episode on wellness and going outside. There was a music lesson where a student learned the blues to show retrieval practice, a technique you should use. Then we baked a muffin for chunking information and had a list of tips for video presentation. Next, there was an episode built with Google Slides on interactive lessons and Easter eggs to hide. Then, requests for feedback with many different tools. Surveys, tests, forms, crowdsourcing can be cool. We learned what to do with input from students whose feedback has value, reflecting is prudent. Likewise, the quality of videos they see is important, but more so, audio is key. We reflected on trauma, universal design, end of semester ideas, teaching online. A workshop on Zoom rounded out our time together, and we've learned that review is a crucial endeavor. Reflect on this series and all that you've learned. It will stay online so you can return to the open space document and each YouTube link. Continue to reflect, continue to think about student-centered learning and accessible design. Reflect and review and your courses will be fine. Thank you all for engaging with the Monday Minute series. I've appreciated your contributions on the open space document, through email, and when you stop by for my Zoom hours. I have one last Zoom session this Wednesday from 1 to 4 p.m. Feel free to stop by and feel free to email me even after my position ends. I'd also like to thank everyone at the Center for Practice, Teaching, and Innovation for the opportunity to work at Gutman this year. And special thanks to Maggie and Christina for ongoing support and guidance. I wish you all the best this year and beyond. Thanks again. Mm -hmm.